know, I like, I totally have it going on. As you can see, my hair is still really silk press and everything. So if you want to see that tutorial, I recently did it. It's going to be on my second channel called France TV. And I'm going to put that link in this bio. Um, also too, um, if you see the little bell at the bottom of this video, click that and you'll be able to be a part of my notification game. And every time I post a video, you will be the first to know. So go ahead and click that notification bell at the bottom of the video and you will be a part of my notification game. I also want to thank each and every one of you guys for subscribing because we have reached a thousand subscribers. That is a big milestone for every YouTuber. It's like a first milestone. And now I'm on my way to 10K and I'm excited. And I really, 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 really thank you guys so much for that because you guys are awesome. And I really thought I was going to reach it by my birthday, which is May 18th. But I reached it way before then. And I'm like, yeah, like, you know. My subscribers is lit. Like, my subscribers are the best. So, thank you guys so much for that. So, in other news, um, your favorite boy band, boy group, is back together day 26. And it's only for one night. They're going to do a, I guess it's a one night only show. They're performing in New York City. Um, tickets go on sale May 1st. So, it's in a few days. And all five guys are going to be there. And... Oh, I already said the tickets go on sale May 1st. And it's going to be at the Highland Ball, Highline Ballroom in New York City. And they all put it on their Twitter accounts. They all put it on their social medias. So you know it's official. I found out on Facebook. I don't live in New York, though. It would be nice to go. But I'm just letting everybody else know that are big fans. I am a big fan of them. But it's just too short notice for me. Um, the... The performance isn't until August, so you have time. They have a website where you can buy tickets and everything. If y'all want me to put that in the description box, let me know. I can. I'm not a promoter for them or nothing like that. But I just thought I'd let everybody know that our fave boy band is back. One of our fave boy bands is back together. Now, if you don't know who Day 26 is, um, Diddy um, did make in the band. He did make in the band four, and he wanted to do a all-guy you know, band. He didn't care what color they were, whatever. They all ended up being five black guys and they chose the name Day 26. <clears throat> so, um, they were also, um, on the label with Danity Kane. They did the show together with Danity Kane, if you remember that. And, um, it was Robert, Brian, Q, Willie, and, um, who did I forget? Robert, oh my God, Robert, uh, Brian, Willie, Q, and Big Mike. So um, Diddy did this big show and announced it in New York City of all the guys who got selected. And it was a big deal. And, you know, all of our hearts were just warm. My favorite group member was Brian. Um, I fell in love with him from the moment that he sung um, End of the Road um, it was like a, 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 a this kind of like battle that they had going on. And I watched that video till this day. Like I have to prove to him that I can sing at the drop of a hat, even if I just woke up. Stand up behind your platoon, man. Stand up behind your platoon. Now I see Brian, he's stepping up in front of me. I ain't no punk, so I'm going to step up in front of him. There's a thousand words that I could say to make you come home, yeah. Seems so long ago you walked away. Sing, sing to him. Don't sing the song to him. Let him hear you. you said to me. I don't know you're coming to get his bed, man. You acting so strange, yeah, yeah. Maybe I was too blind to see that you needed a change. Yeah. The new guy sings, and I'm thinking he's pretty good. It kind of shakes me up a little bit.
Y'all see what y'all facing, you know what I'm saying? That's home team right there. Y'all can say what y'all feel, but good luck to y'all tonight. Tell them whose house it is. That's the moment I fell in love. I was like, man, he can sing. Like, oh my God. Oh my God. Like, I love him. But recently, um, Brian posted a picture of him and Robert. Um, Robert looked so different. Like, I didn't even know who that was. Like, if he wouldn't have said, oh, this is Robert, I would have been like, who is that? But... He recently posted a picture of him and Robert. Everybody went crazy in the comments. Like, does, does this mean we're having a reunion? Does this mean we're having a reunion? I think that I think that this isn't going to be a one night only thing. It's very rare that all five members want to do something. You know, when Danny came and got back together, he was like, nah, man, I'm not doing that. But, but this particular situation, all five of them, you know, they want. I feel like they want this. They want this. They see how crazy the fans are going. I don't feel like they're successful individually they're only successful as a group so i feel like this would be a good power move this would be a good money move this would be everything so um you know what like i don't understand like get back together like we want y'all back together i remember i rem i like i still look for ep i don't know if this is just me i still look for episodes on making the band like till this day because that was just such a good show diddy was very entertaining the whole show was just entertaining and he I, we saw how hard they worked that's really what that, that was good marketing because like diddy had us see them from when they started when they you know made the group when they had to work out when they made big mike lose all that weight and so we just became the love because we see what they went through to get where they were and so I'm just like, you know, like, get back together. But they all going on a, a one night, whatever, performance thing. And um, like I said, they all put it on their Twitter account. So it is official. It was on their Facebook page. It was on their actual Twitter account. And um, I'm just excited for them. They do look different, though. Like, don't don't think you're going to get 2008 D26. Like, the only person who really kept up with themselves was, like, Willie. But we already know Willie from being on Love and Hip Hop too. So we already know how he looks on there. But like a lot of guys kind of, they were kind of in hiding. Like we didn't know what they looked like, what happened to them, if they were doing music. It's like, where y'all was at? Kind of like, um, B, uh, no, not B5. Um, oh God, B2K. Like we only see Fizz and O'Brien. It's like, well, where the rest of y'all at? Like, what are y'all doing? But, um, Day 26 is back together as far as I'm concerned. Um, I think that this performance is going to show them how much they miss each other and how they should get together. And I think that it's going to be great. I'm really excited. I don't know if y'all are excited. I was a big Day 26 fan. Comment below and let me know who was your favorite guy in the group. Um, let me know if you're going to go to the concert. I would love to see a vlog from the concert. I would love to see a video from the concert. But let me know. And I'll see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And um, don't forget to hit that notification button. Bye.